What's up guys, Isaac here. And today I wanna to talk about sticking to the basics, sticking to the bread and butter of most of your games, which is the compound exercises as a natural. See, too many people get um, carried away. They think that by doing a bunch of little isolation, you know, tricep extensions and bicep curls for the girls and stuff of that nature, that they're gonna get huge. And this is partly because they see their favorite bodybuilders doing this all the time. They see, you know, Jay Cutler, Phil Heath, maybe Jeff Side or whoever. And they see these guys doing this and they think that that's the way they're gonna build that muscle. What they fail to understand is that a lot of these guys have already put in 10 years into the gym. They've already put in 12 years, 20 years plus. They've put in the hard yards already. They've built that foundation. You start with the foundation and then you start adding the other layers on top. So they built the foundation and now they're working on the small aspects of the physiques. They're focusing on the isolations to bring up the little bit of their side delt that hasn't been growing or their red delts or anything that's lagging behind to make a more complete physique. Whereas the beginner who hasn't built the foundation is trying to add the little bit to his shoulder when he doesn't even have the big chunk of mass there. So what's the point? You might add a little bit of muscle doing those side laterals or a little bit of muscle doing those chest flies, tricep extensions or whatever. But if your foundation is weak, no one's gonna notice the difference anyway. No one's gonna give a shit. So you really need to focus primarily on the big compounds. Even me at this stage, I've been lifting for about four years and I'm still focusing on the compound exercises. I still do isolation, but I don't really focus on it that much. If I wanna get my arms bigger, I'm gonna do some heavy dips, some heavy close grip bench press. I'm not gonna worry about tricep extensions that much. If I wanna get my shoulders bigger, I'm gonna get my overhead press, try to get that up to two plates. I'm not going to just sit around doing side arrows all day. There's a place and a time. So you need to really put in the hard yes to begin with before you can start working on the isolation. So that's the video for today. It's very simple, very basic, but it can make a huge difference. I remember in my first year, I didn't make that much gains in the first few months because all I was doing was isolation. I didn't build shit. It's only once I started doubling down on the compounds, training legs twice a week, squatting, deadlifting, all that beautiful shit, that I started seeing my body to change. My body started changing. So take that and uh, implement it. If you like the video, like, subscribe, peace.